here in the box, not a bicycle, but it is something called the Kinder Shuttle. The cool thing with the Kinder Shuttle is it's a sled that you can attach to your waist and you can drag your kids, you know, dogs, supplies, uh, around with. Um, a lot of uh, people call them pulk sleds. And it's something that we rent here at the ski area. That way when they have kids, we have a few of these and people can ski and bring their kids with them. Nordic ski centers pretty much allow the pokes. Downhill places, I'm not sure, but I'm sure since I've never been a downhill skier, I'm assuming that there's people that use stuff like this. So this is part of the frame for the covering because it is an encased system. Here's the cover, it's almost like a tent of sorts. Ooh, that's nice. Those must be the tow bars. I have two of them already, so that's a good thing. So I have uh, something to copy with without looking at the instructions. We had one, and then last year we got another, and I'm going to keep trying to get the board members here to, uh, to get me a few of them, because we, at Prospect Mountain, we've been known to rent out of these things. There we go. There's my scissors. It's got some some ribs and uh, when you're skiing over classic tracks uh, the classic tracks are grooves that you machine into the snow so your skis stay nice and straight this will ride over the top without mushing the tracks regular sleds they'll they'll mush out the tracks there we go There's little uh, push tabs. And 
that locks it in place. So it's all pretty simple. And here is where you put the strap that goes around your waist, and we will get to that. That's the strap in the bag. Safety straps. And here is your pad seat with your three point safety harness. It's actually three, four. I don't know if they call that a five point. I'm not exactly sure. Oh yeah, we're getting there. There's a lot of cool features on this. All sorts of vent holes. The plastic covering will unzip. This just stretches down and around. And I'm gonna do, undo the buckles. Give me a little extra play room. Definitely make it a tight fit. So it's got a tailored fit when I'm done. Snaps. Yeah, there's two snaps to go around here. And then, like a pull cord, a stretch cord that snaps around the edges. And as you can see, they definitely make it tight because want to stay I'm almost there let's recenter this there we go now I should be able to get it oh yeah boom This is a vent, just a little wrinkle. Now, I'm just looking at the strap here because you can tighten the straps. And right now it's pretty tight. Actually, they got it sewn. So that's the tightness. It would have been nice if I could have pulled it tighter. But 
that's okay. It's on, it's firm. Center it up. Side track. Put the harness on. And this is the waist strap that goes around a person's waist. And here's a little safety harness, which, believe it or not, my old ones don't have. Now I have to figure out how to do this. I'll have to go look at the other ones. Maybe it's as simple as... No, that's not what that's for. Okay. Maybe it's time to read the instructions. I see how. I see how that works. Let me double check that. So that was the way. Nylon strap through the hole. Safety clip it. Nice. When I rent these out and they come back, sometimes I mix up the arms so it's nice that they're all the same through the years. I didn't remember them having. Yeah, I didn't remember them having any big clips, but they do. Fit. There we go. There's one. This side. I'm sliding this one. That's how that goes. And I'm 
twist this. And there you go. There's a zipper around the side to open it up to get in and out. There's a storage unit. If I can ever get the zipper to work. There we go. Boom. Storage unit. Venting. And you can open up the clear side. Um, a lot of people open it too wide and it drags while they're skiing, but it can be folded in. And um, I should tell people that more because I watch them drag this thing around with it open on warm days. All right, I got the zipper working. Boom, so you could do something like this. The kick can sit on top of it, but a lot of people, I watch them, they do that and just drag it around. Um, some older models had a mesh front for it. It does have a piece of Velcro, so I guess they can do that, but um, most of the time it's zipped up because it is winter and they do the vent and the vent rolls up and velcros around and of course you can open up the back too and fold that in also and that is your kinder shuttle they're actually very nice and as long as the kid is strapped in if the parents do something stupid and the sled rolls over all the kid does is laughs and giggles at the parent who fell down. So these things are fantastic. And I'll show you the two other ones. So got the British Racing Green, got the High Speed Yellow. The yellow is our oldest and most used and still working really well. So uh, I'm happy to have them. Prospect Mountain is... Happy to get another one.